this is Karen Ranzi of Super Healthy Children and I would like to touch on what you should do when you or your child is sick. Um, when I was growing up, my mother, well-intentioned, um, fed me scrambled eggs and toast whenever I was sick and I would have the flu sometimes for a month. And so I learned to do it a little differently with my own children and with myself. Um, whenever there was something that ailed me in any way, I would stop eating. Totally stop food, all food. Um, unless, of course, you just have like a little cold then you just want to keep hydrated and eat lightly of fresh fruit maybe for a day and then fruits and vegetables until you feel better um, before adding the heavier raw foods like nuts, seeds and avocados. But if you're really sick, really not feeling well, you may want to go a little deeper into this and just take a break. Give your digestive system a rest. And what I did is go to sleep. And my children, in turn, saw that example. And whenever they didn't feel well, they also went to sleep. And so they would sometimes sleep for two or three days, as do I if I don't feel well. Um, but I would always make sure to keep them hydrated. And if I didn't feel well, I would make sure that I'm drinking enough water to be hydrated. Um, my daughter would sometimes like a green juice and so if she would wake up and not feel well but want something I would make her a green juice. My son liked um, diluted freshly squeezed orange juice. And so after a couple of days just staying hydrated and getting a tremendous amount of rest there's no way that the sickness can continue. And um, most of the time, my kids would just jump up after a couple of days and say that they felt absolutely great. And so I really do believe that if our body is giving us the sign that we're not feeling well, that we want to just take a digestive break and get as much rest and quality sleep as possible while staying hydrated.